Hello, ladies, gentlemen, boys and girls, have I got a good Sunday morning round of barbecue for you lot today. Now, I'm sure you've seen this account. They are called Jubilee. No, they're called Jubilee, and they just do rubbish videos. One that really tickled me tantals, tickled me, tickled me testicles, shall we say. Six girls versus one secret boy. Well, I know what you're thinking. What the hell's a secret boy? Well, I don't know either, but we're going to find out. We are going to learn today what a secret boy is. If I was taking part of this show, I mean, look, I'm obviously a male. I have a schlong, if you can call it that. If I was taking part in this show, I'll tell you now, I would just get everyone to pull down their trousers. Simple as. You, you're not going to get away with it then are ya? We're gonna watch this. You guys let me know. Fucking work, you bell end. Right, take two. We're gonna watch this. One of them is lying. I think it's probably the man with a beard. I, I don't man. understand why it's not working. <laughs> fucking hell! My name is Natalie, but you can call me Nat. I am from Washington. I recently moved here for work, Ooh, but wow. yeah. Oh, so they've all worked it out. Oh, it's this guy. This guy's the one who's doing it. Oh. Oh, really? Really? I just, I, I don't understand why this doesn't fucking work. Like, a more masculine take on it, because if I was too girly, then it would be too obvious. Holy shit, so it's like, he's faking the voice. I thought he was like a transgender bloke or like someone who didn't want it, you know what I mean? <laughs> I'm in some sambas, black jeans, and like a light green. Top? Okay. From Zara. Let's go like, what's everyone's shoe size? Ooh. Mm. I'm a size 10. 10? Yeah, 10 in women. How tall are you? 5'10. Oh, oh okay. yeah, so that makes sense. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. You're 5'10. I'm, I'm, I'm like 5. Well, I'm saying I'm 5'7, but it kind of rounds out to like 5'8, 9 when I'm, you know, I've got my boots on, got my J's on, you know what I mean? My big shoes, my big toes also give me a bit of a height difference. I'm a short girly. I'm 4'11 without these heels on. <gasps> Uh, on a good day, I'm 5'4", though. I am wearing... <laughs> <laughs> on a good day, I'm 5'4". No, you ain't, bitch. High heels do not count. I'm six foot, and I have a shoe size of nine, so... <laughs> this guy's voice is fucking doing me for one. It's quite good. Um, I'm, like, uh, five foot, um, like, one, and, uh, well, um, yeah. Advert yeah, bastards. I'm coming for everyone with a regular forehead, <laughs> because... <laughs> Y'all sound like y'all got regular forehead. Like, I'm getting regular forehead energy here. <laughs> I think it was a big thing for me. They were laughing a ton, and I was trying to, I was trying to, like, <laughs> it just didn't work out. <laughs> so, yeah, I was trying my best. What's your, like, usual go-to style? For me, not, I think I would say like an urban, like comfy style. I'm not super fancy as a person. So. I like my pajamas. I'm just a pajama gal. I wear them like all day, you know, big slippers with big monsters on the front, um, big long PJs, you know, in bed, cuddling with a hot chocolate and marshmallows and maybe a bit of cream. You know, that's kind of what I like, but you guys let me know what you guys like. What did you guys want to be when like you were a little girl. I really wanted to be a veterinarian. Same. I actually. really loved animals. I still love it. <laughs> Same, actually. Oh my god. I'm like that. Um, actually, I have horses back in Washington. So, <gasps> yeah. Oh my gosh, One I of them's that. name is Scooby Doo. It's great. Scooby Doo. Yeah. I love He's that. adorable. Oh, this guy's killing it. He's absolutely laying flame to this field right now. He's absolutely on light. I assembled like a speech for certain questions, but there were certain questions that were just completely off what they were like off the page, like the horses thing. I just jumped in as soon as I could. I'm like, yeah, I have horses. I don't have horses. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> this dude is way too into it, man. He's way too into it. I must say, though, this is not what I thought it was going to be. I thought there was going to be, like, maybe some sort of transgender person or something like that, and you had to work out which one it was. So I am slightly surprised, but also I think that would probably be quite risky, pulling someone thing like that on, like, well, on YouTube. Probably not the one. I always wanted to be, like, a singer, a songwriter. So that's what I'm trying to do. Okay. Can you sing? So I'm assuming you can sing. Yeah, I do. I write my own songs and I like release them. I write my own songs and like release them. It's no big deal. But like, I kind of got a record label and she's like, oh yeah, I know. I'm fucking famous, but like, don't follow my Instagram. It's uh, at fucking Big Dong Long. Okay. And, and then I got to UCLA and took chemistry. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, we gonna switch that around to something else. <laughs> Were you <pre> Yeah, I was like biochem. I was like, oh, absolutely not. I'm a stand up comedian now, though. I don't so now, now they're voting for who they want kicked off. Do you see? Look at this one. Look at the black lady there with the pig hair. 
<laughs> it's like, bitch, please, what are you looking at? The first question. Okay. Right, what was you guys' first period like? I was just going to ask that. Oh, okay. Perfect. Yeah, we got what a, what a, that's what is straight up, isn't it? Yeah, let, let's, enough, enough being around the bush, baby. What was the first pee like? I want to know how much blood flew. I want to know how the pain was. What did you do? What did you drink? Did you cry? Did you not cry? Yeah. This guy's pretty impressive though to remain calm and then be able to switch into this voice. Like shoved me a pad and said, "Hey, try that. Like put this on." <laughs> and then here, she never. I don't know. It's like maybe it's an Asian thing. She's just never talked to me about it. How dare you say it's an Asian thing? That's racist. Friendly goddamn fire! I had no idea about anything involving periods or anything like that, so I just went with it. <laughs> Name something really specific that only a girl would get. Like specific. Don't just say pad. Um, I have really. <laughs> <laughs> Be real specifics. Oh my god, I'm fucked. I'm fucked. How do you know your period? Like, how do you know when your period's coming? Uh, usually the blood gives it away for me. I just start bleeding. I'm like for JJ. One time at a college party, a guy talked to me for like two seconds, and then the next day I found out that he was telling everyone that I slept with him. What? Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. you say yes as a woman, you're a whore. You say no as a woman, you're a prude. Mm -hmm. If you're somewhere in between. Amen, sister. That's so relatable. I'm com I completely understand what you're talking about. Hey, man, I understand. Yeah, but it's pretty horrible, you know what I mean? Poor girl. What a hard life. Oh, God. Your growth as far as what you feel you should be mentally as a woman. But there's a lot of emotional and spiritual things that you have to do in order to fully evolve to to even volunteer yourself as tribune to say yeah. Yeah. that, um, acknowledge that. Oh, like, oh, I survived that. Like, yeah. you know, like, it's almost like I'm pitting myself. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't even know what to call it. Like, yeah. survivor yeah. and, like, I don't even know. Like, it's just weird. Yeah. It's any, any word that feels comfortable to you. It's quite a serious topic they're touching on. I was going to make a joke, but I'm sort of, like, on the fence. No, we're moving on. <gasps> I did pass one round, that's what I came in here to do today. I'm actually happy that I was the first one voted out, so, yeah. Okay. What a valiant loser. What a, well done. That was poor, though. Come on, mate. You should at least last longer than that. Okay, How do you guys feel about abortion? Oh. Um, you get deep. <laughs> for me, I'm pro-choice. I believe everyone has the decision to do whatever they want with their body. And within pro-choice also exists pro-life if you believe that you are pro-life for yourself. If you don't want to do it, you don't want to do it. If you do want to get an abortion, like you do, like it's fine. Like that's yeah. the whole point of pro-choice, I feel like. So, this is just turning into like a women's advert now, isn't it? I thought we were here to find out who the mall is. They found it. Why are we still watching? Why are we still listening? It's just a, what's your opinion on abortion? Well, like I'm pro-life, but also like kill the f but also like, you know, it's kind of like your body, your rule, your choice. Uh, if you want my opinion on it, um, my opinion on abortion is uh, I don't give a fuck. You do you. Boo 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 boo. Who's like a, like a good like role model that you have, like a woman role model? Really I'm going to bet it. I bet one of them says mother. I don't be cliche, but I'm gonna have to say my mother. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be cliche, but like my mother. And to respect everyone, so I just, yeah. This blonde woman on the right is always speaking when it ends. She needs to learn to stop gobbing off. Look at that lady there with the pink eyes. Look at that picture. <laughs> Look how confused she is. And I just like, and like, you've been kind of really talkative recently, so like, that kind of like red flagged me a little bit. Oh, let me fix that up for you. So. <laughs> <laughs> I like this girl though, she's funny. Can I ask you something, Casey? Yes. What is the, the metal U-shaped thing in your bra? Do you know what that's called? I don't know what that's called. I do not. The underwire? Yeah, the underwire oh, in your the bra. Underwire. I thought you meant something else, because that's like on both cups. What's something that like... She's done. Game over. She must be a transgender in disguise. I'm telling you, she's, she's secretly the mole. They pretended to get a man in, but really it's her. Experience as a woman, or like... Yeah. I'm gonna go boob sweat. Ooh. Oh my gosh, <laughs> so real. Yep. So yeah. real. So real. I get titty sweat all the time, actually. I've got such voluptuous breasts, it's actually quite hard to move about with them sometimes. I don't complain, man. I like it. It tastes good as well. about underwire on the bra i didn't know the answer so i was like okay they're gonna vote me out i knew it <laughs> well, come, well, come a, a little closer, closer and, and we'll tell you what the fuck is and this code girls 30 for 30 percent off your first lilo purchase you're a male Wait, 
it's, it's a weird experience, what? but no. It starts up here, it's cool. It goes 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Whoa! That was insane what he just did there. So when I opened my eyes and saw Zac Efron, I was like, okay. You got me. Like, I really feel like I've been bamboozled. I got bamboozled. Being 6'4", I felt like I was already out of my element, so I had to, like, go in there and try to be somebody that I'm not. Being 6'4", <laughs> I'm already at a massive disadvantage, man. I was, you know, I'm 6'4", I'm a dude, I've got a big-ass beard and a big-ass belly. But tell me, I was already out of my league, man. I was already out of my league. This Claire bitch, she voted me out quicker than a goddamn candlestick, baby. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave it there, because, uh, to be honest, I was kind of hoping for more of a, like, a bit more of a day a bit more of a problem, you know, something like a transgender kid maybe there, and, uh, you know, six girl versus one secret boy, who's the secret boy? boy, boy dressed up as a man maybe, I don't know if I can know, you know what I mean, just like if I can do that. Loads of these videos, if you want to see more, and you're actually interested in this sort of stuff, let me know, because I, I find it quite funny, but I'm going to leave it there, follow them if you want, uh, or more importantly, subscribe to me, oops, sorry, uh, like, comment, all the good shit, my friends, goodbye, good night.